Here we go, guys. Here we go, CNS. Hope you guys are ready for some football because here we go. Dallas Cowboys will beat the Washington Redskins in Washington tonight. Can't wait for it. I've been so excited to see what this team can do in the regular season as opposed to the preseason. Now, a lot of people have been dogging the Cowboys recently for their lack of uh, uh, style points or show points or lack thereof of double digits of points in general in the preseason. But uh, a lot of the players and coaches have been saying, you know, they've been playing with a, quote, vanilla um, playbook lately. They, they, they don't want to show off everything they have. And I'm going to go ahead and give them the benefit of the doubt because we haven't seen a regular season game play yet. And uh, a lot of the Redskins fans are citing that uh, because they have a new coach, because they have uh, Donovan McNabb, that they are so much of a better team. And, you know, Donovan McNabb's a fantastic player. I mean, I'm going to go ahead and chunk that up to you guys. But unfortunately, even when he was playing for the Eagles, uh, we we managed to take care of him plenty of times. But uh, here's a couple of keys for that Dallas needs to know. Uh, of course, I just got off yet another overnight shift for Channel 4. So same uh, same process allows. I am going to make this video real quick and then head off to church, come back, climb in my bed, die for a little while, and then wake up in time for the game. Uh, here's uh, some things that we got to watch out for, Cowboys. Um, we've had a couple injuries go down on the offensive line, so we're probably going to stick a couple of newer, fresher bodies in there and look for that matchup to be important because when I look for that, when I look for the two new guys having to stack up against guys like Albert Hainsworth and Brian Arakpo, that, that matchup is going to be more important than people think. Uh, so the offensive line is definitely going to work as one unit, tighten up, protect Tony Romo at all costs because – with the talent that we have on this offense, th this offense has every capability to be explosive as it can be. Whether or not Des Bryant coming back will make a difference in that, we don't know yet. It's the first regular season game, but I look for I look for Bryant to have a good game. I look for Miles Austin to have a great game. Um, uh, I kind of want to see Tony Romo pass more to Jason Witten, but we might need Witten to block more than catch this game. We don't know. Um, also. Um, we need to pressure Donovan McNabb because if Donovan McNabb gets time and say he gets the ball to someone like Santana Moss, uh, that could bring life into this Redskins offense. So definitely we're gonna rely on uh, we're gonna we're gonna rely on Ratliff and Victor Butler, Demarcus Ware, all those guys to disrupt Donovan McNabb as much as possible. And I hate to say this, but mm, they're, they're gonna have to uh, capitalize on the relative newness of left tackle Trent Williams, one of my Sooners. Ugh. You know, I, I I said this before, Trent Williams, you play for the Redskins. I don't know why, but I, I, I will wish for the best career for you, except when you're playing my Cowboys. On this game, ugh, uh, on this game, I hope you get beat, uh, and I hope Donovan McNabb gets sacked. Sorry, Trent. Uh, you're my boy. You were my boy when you played for Oklahoma, but now you're playing for against the Cowboys. So I got to hope you don't do too well this game. But for every other game, I hope you do really well. Um, so uh, those are my keys, really. Just Dallas has to just realize that we are Dallas, realize that we have this explosive offense, and just use it. Play this game, come out, because when we have a team that has the potential – to not only repeat to take the NFC East, but to go farther in the playoffs, not to get embarrassed by the Minnesota Vikings yet again, but on only the potential to be in the Super Bowl and to have that added pressure of making it to the Super Bowl so we can have it, the home field advantage. At, at one point, we had to forget about that and just take it one game at a time. But at the same time, we had to use that as motivation, fuel on the fire. But guys, I look for Dallas to have a great game tonight. Redskins are dead skins, CNS. Let's do this. How about them, Cowboys? It's game time tonight. You ready for some football? Let's go.